So you asked about the definition of the disorder, and there's uh, uh, some quick ways to think about it. One is that these are people who have problems in multiple areas of psychopathology, in interpersonal relationships, in their emotional regulation, and in their impulse control. And no other disorder really has major problems in all three of those areas within the same person. It used to be thought that there's just sort of, these are common problems in the general population, they just coincide in some people. But the genetic research has now suggested that there's a latent uh, inherent coherence to their integrating factor, that uh, something genetically inherited integrates these three, and so it's not simply the chance occurrence of common phenomena. A second thing is that while the syndrome is composed of many different and each of them important components, in practice, um, if you have somebody who has severe abandonment fears and who cuts themselves, you've got an 88% chance that that person has borderline personality disorder. It's not that hard clinically. Um, and people have those two things. Um, it doesn't take much else.